Hello and welcome back to Fallout 76. Today we're going to talk about Cremator Explosions. Cremator is from the current season's board. It's one of the, uh, it's the new weapon you can claim. It is a lot of fun to use, does a lot of damage, and because of that, it's actually quite popular. But it also is quite frustrating if you're not the one using it, or maybe even if you are the one using it, because the explosions can be quite blinding. Now, for some reason, we don't have an option in the game to disable or turn down the explosive visual effects of weapons. So we are forced to turn to mods for that. Luckily, there is a mod that will actually uh, reduce or eliminate the explosion from the cremator. Now, it is just a visual effect. It doesn't actually affect the area that it covers. It doesn't affect how much damage it does, but visually, it will look different. Now, the downside is this is a solution for PC. As far as I know, consoles don't have any options available to them. So this is the mod on the Nexus. It's called No Cremator Explosion. And the mod author is Indigenous Alien. So thank you to whoever that person is. You did a very nice job with this mod. If you have never installed a mod before, I do have instructions, kind of general instructions on how to install a mod in the description below. The instructions are general because it can vary depending on your PC. File locations can be different. And if you've done this before, you don't need any instructions from me. There's also a link to the mod in the description below. So the mod is actually three different files that give you different options. They'll give you different effects. So I have run each one of these separately and based on what I've seen with them, you don't really need to run the, I, I don't know what the effect would be if you ran them all at once. Uh, I don't think you would really need to. So I'm not gonna show you what it looks like if you're running all of them at once. I'll just show you each one and what they do. But the first one we have is just cremator particles, the description for the folks that want to keep the spark effect and a small impact flash to see where the projectile lands works with all colors. The second option is no cremator explosion, removes the cremator explosive effect for all colors. And the last one is smaller cremator explosion, reduces the overall size of the explosion, explosion effect by 5X, but retains the majority of the effects intended to be used with level two grenadier perk. Otherwise the explosive effect becomes comically small, does not affect area of effect damage of the explosion. And that just means that it doesn't affect how much damage you do. It just affects what it looks like visually. So this is, first I'll show you what it looks like. I have no mods on at all right now and I'm not running grenadier. You can see right there, no Grenadier at all equipped. So this is what it looks like without Grenadier. You can see the explosions aren't actually that big. And I think if people ran it without Grenadier, you probably wouldn't need mods uh, to adjust the visuals. The problem with that is this gun really wants Grenadier. You want to increase the area of effect damage as much as possible. So it doesn't really make a lot of sense to run it without Grenadier. So I think most of the, most of the people who run this weapon are running it with Grenadier. And now we have Grenadier equipped. And again, not using mods, this is what it looks like normally. And you can see the explosive effect is quite large. And if you're in an event with a, more than a few people using this weapon, uh, it can be quite blinding. And if you're, especially if a melee character, if you're kind of in the thick of it uh, and you've got this going off around you, it can be, uh, yeah, and you can see my health bar just draining right there because the area of effect is quite large. The area of effect can be quite blinding to you. So you can actually go through a whole event where you just really don't see anything at all. And that's kind of frustrating. And it's not really fair to ask people who use this weapon and like it not to use it. Uh, at the same time, I do want to be able to see. And I still, I don't understand why there's no option in the menu to adjust those settings. So I will be running Grenadier for the demonstration of all the different uh, mod options that we have. So this first one, this is if you're using the, the mod, the Just Cremator Particles option. This is what it looks like. We'll stand back a little bit. You can still see the projectile travel. But then when it hits, you just basically see just pixie dust, I guess, uh, in the thing. So this is just visuals. But you can see, even though we're not seeing a uh, an explosion at the end, you can see my health bar still melting. So the area of effect, and you can see I'm on fire. So the area of effect is uh, not changed at all. It's just a visual thing. So this is actually a pretty nice option if you are just, if you're not using it, that's very... <laughs> That'd be kind of cool. Have a, actually a flaming effect on your armor. That'd be kind of fun, actually, if it wasn't draining my health, that is. But I think this is a pretty good option. If you are not interested in explosions at all, you don't even want to see the effect. You'll still hear it. Enemies will still die. But if you're at an event with a lot of people that are using this weapon, you're basically going to see maybe a streak of something. And that's about it. And then the uh, pixie dust and no explosion at all. Next up, we have the no cremator explosion option, and this is what it looks like. So you still see the streak, but you don't see anything on impact. It just kind of vanishes, which if I'm using this, it's a little disconcerting, but if I am not the user, if it's just a bunch of people shooting them, 
This would be probably a kind of a fun option, but you could see I'm still being affected. You can see my health draining. So I got a little bit of splashback. So even though I didn't see, which is another reason why I probably want to see an explosion if I'm using it. But you can see if I'm using it and I shoot it, I'm still affected. I'm not that close, but now I'm on fire. So even though we're not seeing an explosion, it uh, still doing its thing. And you'll hear the impact as well right there. So you'll hear the explosion and whatever, but you won't see anything. So this is an option. This is, this is not my favorite one of the three, but uh, this is definitely an option. All right, and the third option is the smaller cremator explosion option. So when you fire, you still see an explosion, but you can see it is much smaller. Let's take off Grenadier. It did, the description said without Grenadier, it was comically small. So let's see what that looks like. Yeah, that is, uh, <laughs> that is comically small, but that's without Grenadier. And I just don't think running this weapon without Grenadier makes a lot of sense. So let's put it back on. So I think my my preferred way to do it, if I'm going to run the Cremator, like I'm the one using it, I think I prefer the smaller explosions option. Uh, I think it's it still gives you kind of the feel of it without just being completely blinding to myself. And uh, if I'm not running a Cremator, if I just want to shut down everyone else's stuff, then I'm going to go with probably the uh, particles option, which basically it still shows the uh, the trail from the fire, but at the end it just gives you pixie dust. And there you have it, a look at a mod for those of us on PC that allows us to be no longer blinded by the cremator explosions. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit one of the buttons and I hope you'll join me in the next one. Thank you very much.